Hi everyone, this is Cindy with Create with Cindy and I'm in the process of doing a little update with my purple guest room. These were previously just, you know, white dresser and a couple white nightstands and if you're interested in seeing how they look before, check out the video that says um, purple guest room. So anyway, I've been admiring the uh, mirrored furniture that I've seen at you know, home goods, at home, Marshalls, those places. And so I've looked around. I thought, well, you know, I think I can just take what we have and update. So that's what we did. Measured uh, the drawers and um, uh, went to a small hardware, lumber, glass cutting place. And we had these cut for, I guess, the eight for about uh, $40. Okay, brought them home, took the drawers out, took the handles off, and these are the handles that were on there, and I'm going to keep them, you know, I might, I might use them for something else, another project, and so uh, we used the liquid nails, my husband has a caulking gun, and so that's what was used to put the mirror on there is nice thing about liquid nails is you don't have to worry about uh, getting things on there real quick it takes about two or three hours for it to get tacky so what you can do is uh, put it on the wood and then all the drawers and then put the mirror on there and let's say this was the drawer we went around about an inch from the edges. You don't want it right at the edge because then when you put the mirror down it'll squish out. So just go around just like that and then make a crisscross. Press the mirror down and uh, we didn't lay anything on it and it was fine. They were uh, on there. We left them alone for about two or three days for the dresser. And then for the nightstands, we went on a little trip, and so they were on there for about a week. Uh, then after that, we used our knobs. Now, I purchased some knobs at um, Marshall's. You know, the boxes, the box that came in where you have 12, I think it was about $8 or something. And I think that's really good unless you go to Home Depot, I mean, not Home Depot, but Hobby Lobby where they have them half off or use your coupon because some of those knobs can be pretty expensive. They've got a great selection. But um, I got these at Marshall's. Only thing was they had a long screw. I think this was one of the screws. And that screw was not coming out. So my husband has a vise and um, he used a little hacksaw and so he had to take that screw off like that. So when you're looking for knobs, um, unless you're going to have holes um, drilled in the mirrors, which we didn't want to go through all that, we just wanted to glue them on, um, look for knobs that the screw will come out or that it doesn't have a screw and you just, you have to have, you know, you have to get your own screw. But this had the screw in it so he had to take it down like that so that it would be flush on the mirror. So after that we put them on with the liquid nails and also I put a couple on with um, hot glue. So, so far so good. You know, it's staying on there, no problem. Um, generally when I pull it open I do pull by the, both sides so as not to put pressure on the knobs. But so far it's doing real well and I am just really pleased with my new mirrored furniture. So anyway, if you have some old furniture or whatnot you want to kind of update, you can do that. I want to thank those that have subscribed and if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. And I'm going to have some more projects this coming summer. And thanks so much for watching. This is Cindy.